Well, here's a video of some old fans that I've got. I've got lots of old fans and um, in this room and I'm going to be showing off some. So right here is a Expolaris fan that I used when I was renovating the shed. In. It works perfectly. Nothing wrong with that. We're showing off basically all of them. Next we have a pie. My nana got it for thirty dollars back in the day. Uh, well, that was ages ago. She got it for me. Still works fine. There's nothing absolutely wrong with it. It's slow. Got that running right now. It's a glen here. Hi. Use this during the summer once. So. I use this every day, basically. She likes to use it on Louvre. And they use it, it's a bit too noisy. Let's have this mini airflow 12. No. Had some lubricant before, but it didn't, didn't seem to do anything. Fan because well that's completely a bit stuff. The boy in our box fan. Next up is Hitachi, this retro Hitachi desk fan. It's got the gray cord. Works perfectly. There's nothing wrong with it at all. Desk fan. It's got really, 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 really good spin down on it. So. It's not actually on. Then this was testing tag. So, um, not got it. Salvo's stories. Must have got it at Salvo's or something. They had it test and tagged or something. I don't know. That works fine. Air Force 16 desk fan. Vibrates everything. Once it gets going, it's a real, real air mover. And I'm high. This is 
stop writing this one. Louver doesn't work very well. Two here. So, um, yeah, I need to fix that. Hi. Next is Hanamex fan. Move this down. Um, we got three as low. I'm not sure why. I can't really get there. Let me just stand on this. Oh, is that official or something? Like that? I think I had it isolated in here. about to move the rifle layer. Off. Oh, I've got a few Mr. Gyro Airbox fans, but they're inside if you're wondering where they are. One's in my wardrobe. Um, the one with the box is in its box, but it's Standing on this bench. Right, I'm not gonna block the air, but it's behind there for where I this is my collection so far. Probably gonna move things around today. one and off used it a little bit when I got it for when I was doing work over on that bench but I haven't used it since I turned it off yesterday it was actually fitting this There's this puke coloured cord on it. Probably this is pieced and on it, like some things kind of stuff. It's got the three speed control, we'll start from a lot. I'm not sure what that noise is. It's actually coming from the cage. It doesn't isolate. Oh, stop quivering. That would hurt so much if I got my finger jammed in that. I'm thinking about putting some more up there as well. It's the antique Revelaire. Got for $20.
This is not the only one I have. I've got two. The other one is not the same control, it's a different control. And then we have this Glen Air Box fans. Turn it off for you as he's been down from low. Gave it a big clean up the other day. It's a really, really good spin down. There we go. I, I just keep it on to circulate air in here. We've got the watt marks, the ceiling fan, our lamps, and ceiling fan up in here. None here right this second. Over there. There we go for now. Um. Let's just look at some old antique and old desk fans and stuff. Um, yeah, there's a very old trade wind stand fan. An old sun air to stuff for Kim. This is featuring lots of stuff in the shed. I've got to show off this antique Mac industrial exhaust fan. Super heavy. Well, it's like a ceiling fan, but doesn't matter. It's super heavy, but I can lift it. How's that work? I don't know. Just hitting the back of it. I turn off before it breaks the cord itself. So. Such a good amount of air. And it's so made by Mac. Actually, sure where it says on it, but I'm sure it does say. I know it does say somewhere. I can't find it right now. That's off. That's all off. Um, the Glen Air box fan is five blades. So it's not as good, but uh, anyway, it's still good. Here's some old antique switches if you're into switches. Sure, their brands. One's a bit stuffed. If you're into lots of switches, I've got all of these. And yeah, I've got this really rare one apparently. A ring rip. Very old and rare. Um, the exhaust fan I use a lot. The only fan, let's give that a run, I suppose. This one is not a bit wobbly, though. Let me fix that. Had to be wired the way it is because I can't get the thing down the down rod. It's not only in here. I have antique fans. I have lots of antique fans inside too. Come with me, come with me and have a look. Got this old baker like gold here. 
You do not want to get your fingers chopped in that because otherwise you're going to do something. Take this one. You notice that's that. There's my second rebel layer. Two. One. Does isolate, just needs a bit of boost. Medium, yeah, but now it's isolated. Sometimes the isolation gets a bit stuffed. Oh no, that's nice. Mistral gyro air in there, and I want right there. Okay, let's get up in the middle. I've also got the Slimline and the KDK Auto Breather. I've also got this. on the back so okay. oh, I've also got this Westing house up here I can't bother running because I did a video not long ago. Yeah, thanks for watching. That will conclude all my, most of my old fans. Um, yeah. I'll see you guys in another video. Um, yeah. Bye.